Today, I'm going to show you how you can find unexpected emission data for your next Great Fight Efficient Weapons Upgrade. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Down to Earth Astronomy and Elite Dangerous. This is going to be the last video in my uh, my well recently ongoing series of how to find different types of materials and today we're looking at to yes thank you i will <laughs> sorry today we're looking at scanning satellites outside stations you can see here that we are currently outside uh jeffrey's port which is in the ukriviri system something like that um Again, there's a full list of different locations because there are many of these different locations. I'm just showcasing one of them. Uh, so link to different des uh, destinations in the description down below so you can find the one closest to you. But anyway, what you're going to do is you're going to come to one of some of these locations. Oh. And um, and at these locations, you would often see these uh, capital ship docks where there are ships under repair. And next to these, um, next to these docks, you will see, if you go to the context tab, these satellites that spawn. If you lock one of the satellites, it's over there, and you scan it, just point your ship at it, keep it locked, Incoming message. you get a piece of data. Now this time I got tagged encryption codes. Um, this might not be what we were looking for, so we're just going to target the next satellite, scan that, um, and we're probably hopefully going to get something a little bit more useful. Now, I have also put a list of uh, a typical. Okay, nice. I've also put a list of um, of all the data that I've been able to find doing this. Um, so there's a full list of data. This is both include experimental scrambled emission data that you need for your Grade Three specialized shield cell bank upgrades, um, but also the unexpected emission data that you need for your Grade Five uh, efficient weapons, which I assume you are going to uh, to do since you are here. Um, and from here it's pretty easy, once you scan the satellites, you can simply just board hop. So go out to the main menu, log into another session, I was just in a private group. So let's just jump into a solo play. Um, you'll spawn in next to the station again, just outside the station perimeter. There we go. There's the first satellite, just straight ahead of you. And you will probably all also spawn facing it, so it's pretty easy. So just scan it and uh, let's see if we're lucky this time. Irregular emission data, still not what we're looking for. So let's see if we're more lucky. It, there was spawn either two or three, it depends. So this time we got three of them. Um, it's a little random, I haven't really found any pattern in when they open symmetric keys, still not what we're looking for. I would really love it if we could get one of the right types of data just to, to showcase. And here's the last satellite. Um, but anyway, it's pretty simple. You just yeah, scan them and board hop until you got all the data you need. Um, let's see what we got in the last one. Irregular emission data. Okay, so still no luck. Um, again, as you can see here, you can't be unlucky. You just have to keep at it. Trust me, the data will come at some point. But anyway, very short video. Hope you found it useful. If you did, give it a like down below. Consider subscribing to the channel or becoming a Patreon if you really want to support the channel. Um, thanks a lot for watching and until next time. I'll see you guys in space.